Yes, and here we are, folks. Map Fiction, my name. And we're here for roadside reviews of greatest cricket books ever written, reviewed on the side of the road. And have a look at that road there. Magnificent stretch of bitumen. And Matt Ellis is with me as always. Now, Matt, can you tell us what have you got for us today? Well, thanks, Matt. It's been great traveling with you and our viewers will be able to see that right there. Mike Atherton opening up my autobiography. Now, there's a few things I like about this. Just, just for starters, the title for an opening batsman to have opening up. It's, it's got a bit of class about it, doesn't it? And there we go, Ather's on the back cover. Obviously didn't face Glenn McGrath that day. He's looking quite happy with himself. Uh, but but a, a great read, Matt. Now, Matt, can you tell us when you first read this one? Well, uh, truth be told, Matt, this one is more a bit of a social capital piece for me. I keep it on my bookshelf. I carry it around in my vehicle. I like people to know that I've got it. But the truth be told, I haven't read the paper version of the book. I've taken a shortcut, so to speak, and I got a copy of Ather's reading it. Can you imagine how great that would be, listening to Mike Atherton read his own story? And that's what I did. It, it was a great way to get through it. Uh, first read it uh, not long after it was released. It was probably in closed reserve at my local cricket library at the time and uh, made the time to go down and listen to that one and really appreciated it indeed. Now, Matt, how do you rate Athers as a cricketer? Yeah, I thought we were doing a book review here, Matt. I don't know. I don't want to get too controversial, but Athers, I, I like Mike Atherton because he batted in a similar fashion to myself. He scored a lot more runs than me, but he wasn't too flashy or flamboyant. Uh, and he did his best to get runs with the skills that he had. And I really appreciated the way he went about his business. And from an Australian point of view, I, I did enjoy seeing Glenn McGrath knock him over occasionally as well. Yes, well, Matt, thanks so much for joining us on the side of the road. If you'd like to read this one, it is available at all good cricket libraries for borrow, and it's out of the closed reserve now, so you can get that one. Mike Atherton opening up. This has been Roadside Reviews, the greatest cricket books ever written, reviewed on the side of the road with Matt Fiction and Matt Ellis.